Firmness is an important quality characteristic of table grapes. Consumers prefer grapes that are firm and crisp in texture rather than those that are watery and soft because firmness signifies freshness to the customer. This short Inno Grape video aims to summarise the factors that influence berry firmness and the fertiliser practices promoted to increase and maintain firmness. Visually, firm berries have opaque, white-coloured flesh, while soft berries have a jelly-like translucent flesh. By most observations, the thicker the layer of opaque flesh, the firmer the berry is. But to understand more about berry firmness, we need to look closer to the plant's cellular level. Berry firmness is influenced by characteristics of the cells that compose the berry flesh. Each plant cell is surrounded externally by a cell wall. The cell wall is made partly of cellulose molecules that give the cell its strength and rigidity. Internally, cells contain semi-permeable membranes that regulate the movement of substances like salts, sugar and water in and out of the cell. Water uptake into the cell by osmosis forces the membrane outward and against the rigid cell wall. The pressure that builds within the cell is called turgor pressure. The rise in pressure results in firmer or turgid cells in the berry flesh and firmer berries overall. Of the management practices promoted to increase berry firmness, calcium fertiliser applications are often very popular. Calcium plays a major role in cell wall structure and acts to bind cells together. Calcium also inhibits cell wall degrading enzymes during fruit ripening and tissue softening. Calcium is transported in grapevines only through the xylem, the tissue that transports water and nutrients from roots to shoots and leaves. Xylem water flow from the vine to the grape berries decreases substantially during berry ripening. As a result, accumulation of calcium in the berry is also slow during this time. From a management perspective, calcium fertilisers should be applied earlier in vine and berry development and prior to the ripening phase when berry calcium uptake may be compromised. Potassium plays a very important role in cell water status and as a result may affect berry firmness. It is readily transported through the grapevine by both the xylem and phloem tissues. Developing fruit has a strong demand for potassium and its content increases substantially during the ripening phase. Ripe berries have about 15 times more potassium than green berries. Plant cell membranes are highly permeable to potassium. Active cellular uptake of potassium ions produces an osmotic gradient that drives water into plant cells. Consequently, turgor pressure increases and cells and berries become turgid and firm. Potassium fertilisers are often applied during the early spring, a few weeks after bud burst and up to fruit ripening so that it is available to support berry growth and development and grapevine water status, which ultimately influences berry firmness and provides an enjoyable eating experience for the consumer. This video is brought to you by InnoGrape, a table grape extension program supported by the Australian Table Grape Association with funding from the Foundation for Rural and Regional Renewal and the William Buckland Foundation.